Hey folks, this is Jake Davis, and on the fly review for you. And today I'm talking about the 355, released last week and directed by Simon Kinberg, starring Jessica Chastain, Lupita Nyong'o, Diane Kruger, Bing Bing Fan, Penelope Cruz, Sebastian Stan, uh, Jason Fleming, and Edgar Ramirez. The um, uh, whole deal with this movie is five spies from five different countries all find themselves basically involved in the same case and decide to work together to save the world. Um, quite frankly, on its surface, I think, even with an all-female cast, I think it's a fine pitch for an action movie or a, or a fine gimmick for an action movie or a comic book or a TV show, something like that. I, could, I think it could work. Or at least could be fun. You know, as a Quentin Tarantino when he <laughs> wrote Pulp Fiction, it's Fox Force Five. I mean, what the hell, guys? The uh, yeah. but I think the problem with this movie is it takes itself far, far too seriously. Uh, this movie could, could have used a little humor, a little personality, and it's really not there. Um, I thought the girls were all good in their roles. Uh. I actually thought Diane Kruger was quite good in this. Um, but, you know, the movie's very, very predictable. And, uh, I mean, spoiler here, but <laughs> the our, our main character is closely involved with a person who gets killed, who gets killed off off screen without her seeing the body in the first act. Oh, I wonder who the villain will be. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure it's a pro it was a real surprise to anyone who never saw GoldenEye or Mission Impossible or SWAT. Or, you know, if this is just the first action movie you've ever seen in general, you may have been surprised. Did you break that umbrella? <laughs> she broke the umbrella. Anyhow. Uh, yeah, man, it was just... I didn't hate it, but it's not a good movie. You know, I mean, I think critics are being a little, a little hard on it. It's not, I mean, there's one real cringy moment right towards the end. But, I mean, that's, that's about it. I mean, the actions, if, the truth is, if I could sum this movie up in one single word, it would be bland. It's a bland film. It is, uh... It's just, it's just there. It's there. Anyhow, I guess I'll give it two and a half stars. Uh, I mean, it, at least it's better than Simon Kinberg's last movie, it's been Dark Phoenix. I mean, that had the fucking Etz Men in it. And it, this is more watchable. Anyhow, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I'm Jake Davis, and I'll catch you on the fly. Got a fucking fish umbrella now.